What's going on there, guys? This is Quinn, that snazzy iPhone guy, and this is Triple T Terminal Tip Tuesday. Now, this is very exciting for me today because Triple T videos, as you all know, are pretty short. And I just got back from the video game store because I picked up L.A. Noir, Rockstar's latest release for Xbox 360 and PS3. This game is three freaking discs long. I am so excited. It's going to be sick. But that's aside the point. Short video today, but it is useful. Now, I've always told you to back up. It's very important that you back up. And if you don't back up, you're stupid. You deserve to lose all your files. That was rude. But back up, really. Uh, I don't use super duper, excuse me, I don't use time machine to back up. I use super duper. Uh, it's just something that I've always used. I prefer it. I feel as though it's a little bit less CPU intensive, but a lot of people like time machine. It comes on your OS. It's very beautiful when you do need to recover files and it does it all automatically and seamlessly. So there's an advantage to it. The problem is, is it backs up every hour. Now for some, this may be great, but for a lot of people, this is too often. You don't need something being backed up every hour. And the reasons this is bad is it keeps your drives running so they don't get a chance to rest, which means uh, their lifespan may be uh, shorter and you may end up having a failed hard drive, which is worse than um, you know not having a backup. So um, that's one of the problems that they have. And the other problem is when your hard drive is large, it takes more than an hour to back up. So you're constantly just in a total overlap space, which uh, is very CPU and memory intensive. And uh, it's one of the reasons I don't like Time Machine. However, there is a very cool terminal tip which you can use to select the interval in which Time Machine backs up. So what you need to do is go to Terminal. You can find it in Spotlight by searching T-E-R-M-I-N-A-L or open your finder, navigate to the applications, and then under Applications, you'll find Utilities, and there it is, Terminal. Now, the command is already pasted onto my clipboard. All you need to do is paste it, and you can find it below in the description below. Now, right there, I had... 1800. 3600 is the default, and uh, that's in intervals of seconds. So um, every 100, or excuse me, every one hour, your time machine backs up every 3600 seconds. Now you could do it every half hour by selecting 1800, or you could do it, um, math is hard, is it 86, 4? I think that's every day. I'm trying to remember my maths. Maths is hard. Uh, yeah, I think 86,400 is, let's try it. Hold on real quick. 3,600 times 24. Oh, I'm good at math. All right, 86,400 seconds is one day, which is great because let's say, okay, I don't need to back up every hour, but I would like to back up every day. All you do then is you press enter or return. It'll ask you for your password and you do need to enter that just because you're requesting pseudo access or root access. And then that will change. You're good to go. And uh, you can change the interval in seconds from one to one million on how often you'd like to back up Time Machine. Thanks so much for watching. Please subscribe, rate, comment, and as always, stay snazzy. See you later, folks.